Yo, it's Death for the Cloud Chaser TV, man. We back up in this thing again, you dig? Hey, you know we got another special one for you, man. We got Sirius Jones in the mix, you feel me? Like, so this Tay Rock situation, so you know what I'm saying? It's up and, you know, it's smoke, you know what I'm saying? It's a back and forth. But, mm -hmm. bro, during the battle, y'all had this situation that's going viral, right? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Y'all almost come to blows, correct? No, that's not correct. So what what happened in that situation? Why were people putting out on social said, media? If you that got was cool with the bands, and if you slingshot, then why okay. they got a whole rock back all the time? That's not T Rock is. I was started to do this whole segment where I just gave him names like, you know what? We're gonna call you Edward James, almost like 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 he's. Always the almost fight guy. That's what he does. He's always arguing, yelling with somebody in the ring. Has it led to a fight yet? Yeah, he has 55 battles. He doesn't have one battle rap actual fight on the stage that I know of. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So that's not to take anything away from him. I'm not trying to play him because, you know, I had a conversation with him outside afterwards and his girl about taking a shot up and about mm -hmm. coming home to a law. Yes, yeah, sir. Sure. Come on, man. We on this. We on. We on black people time. Like I'm not with the whole. So you think that the media cool. blew it up? Like the media oh, just man, pretty that's much. Their job, that. But no. But honestly and ironically, that's the reason why he's acting like that in the first place. Because in his mind, people are looking. Yeah, social and media. And he's feeling away. The fact that I'm all in, going in his face, wilding on him like this. You know what I'm saying? And I, I actually, I actually did accidentally like poke him or something like that but it was clearly an accident and i think i apologized but he just continued to you mm -hmm. know what i mean and i guess he, he was feeling the way because he was losing probably so otherwise if you win in the battle you really don't be that upset right right you might just be like hi yeah yeah don't do that again nigga. but you just about kick your ass uh, uh, unless you knew somebody was really trying to disrespect you or play you that wasn't my energy you know what i'm saying i'm rapping i'm clearly there to rap I'm 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 passionate about every bar. I'm, I'm in here. I'm in the bag. I'm clearly not here doing this to try and just punk you or or, or you know what I mean. I'm not pushing you. And I did one bar where I bumped him. That I told him I was going to do that. And then other than that, I was just really in his face. So if I touch you by accident, my nigga, like let's not try to make a big thing out of it and then act like. But the reality of it is, it's a blessing that it didn't go any further because. <sighs> Y'all don't want that, man. Like, PP, I swear. Yeah. I don't want that. But I'm just being honest. Like, people don't want that side of me. I don't know why anybody would think that's good to even try and, like, pro promote or provoke that. Because once you go there, there's no turning back. And then what? Then so I done like, crashed out. People... He done crashed out or whatever. Mm -hmm. It's like, I don't know why people think that's a cool thing to provoke. Because when it comes down to it, nobody really wins. No, that's a fact. And then, like, do you think that, like, in that in that sense, like, some people can't take the – it's, like, almost like basketball. I get that scenario. You know what I'm saying? Some yeah. people talk about the MJ era. They talk about the LeBron era. Right. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to physical, right? Some people couldn't play in that MJ yeah, era. Play, right? So you think battle rap has, has evolved in, in that type of sport, like, when it comes to, like, okay, back in the day, you know what I'm saying? People going to take that, take that. Then – come now is more well, so like what that's a deep question honestly brother because honestly it's the opposite back in the day you didn't we didn't play that touch you shit when you battle there wasn't no bumping and the only time that that something like that would happen is if it was really like a real smoky situation where niggas really ain't like each other and it probably did almost or come to blows if niggas touched each other that's why they came up with the pool table concept for fight club we right. got a pool table between you niggas. You can't get to each other, even if you want to. You know what I'm saying? So that whole bumping people, and I'm not against a, a, a heightened energy, aggressive battle, as long as it's between two what? MCs, man. All these people that use this battle rap platform or any rap platform to live out their street thug fantasies and all that and act and talk the way you think you're supposed to as a, as a tough guy, to me, that's just the death of this, bro. Mm -hmm. And it's like, I think people get it misconstrued because some people don't know my life or my struggles or the kind of place and the kind of situations that I actually really come from. 
whenever I'm getting into that energy or whenever I react in like a real woofy way, they act like it's like me trying to act like that. And they're like, bro, you don't even understand. To me, this is the escape from that. This is this is my savior to keep me out of that world. So when right. I come here and, and I'm getting paid by these corporations or these, these companies or we in these rooms with these clipboards and white people and, and mics and cameras, and this is where you want to come and be skanked at? 